now. See, they ain't got this one. Just sitting. Come out when I come out. Go the same way. See? How convenient is this? Like, you still gonna follow me after all that shit? Like, really? I mean, there's a chance they could have been dropping dude off back there. But, if they was dropping dude off, why wouldn't they just pull out when dude was going in? And, you know, it seems like they let an awful lot of felons out. Because I've I, I seen quite a few. So, if something happens to me, each person at the address on my ID needs to be polygraphed at the state police barracks. And I'm even wanting to take one that proves that whatever, you know, people go through and have to deal with actually happens. Because I'm tired of it happening. I'm tired of this shit missing, like, you know, right out my bag, like, straight up, like, you know, like it belonged to somebody else. Or, you know, the memo is put out by our own government. Prepare for things. Be on top of shit. I try and try my hardest to do it. Try. And yet, shit comes up missing. Now, I've told about, I would say, I would guesstimate at about 10 professional people the ACLU and a lawyer. I'm supposed to be moving, I'm waiting on somebody to pay me and do to be at an apartment by next week so if something happens to me could be read motivated hate motivated could just be could, could be a number of things but I know that I'm a widowed father of three, and I wouldn't leave this earth. I wouldn't leave this earth for nothing. So, that's just it. Shit just got a really eerie, creepy feel to it tonight. Almost like I'm supposed to feel and believe and trust and I can't trust people at all anymore. I'm sorry, like trust went out the window for me a long time ago when people started following me. Now, like I said, hey, I'm willing to take a polygraph in front of the Senate, Supreme Court. I mean, I'm sure the Supreme Court would wonder why certain things are going on in our own country. This is stuff that happens to our ambassador, you know, the embassies across seas, not in America. So, you 
no. I'm willing to take that polygraph test. I don't want this to happen to somebody else. No one, no one, and I repeat that again, no one should have to go through being followed, stalked, and hunted like freaking prey. Someone is stalking you, hunting you like prey, and you suffer from anxiety, PTSD, anything that's debilitating, that would make it hard for you, that would make it hard for you, damn my foot just got soaked. I think my umbrella is shot. That and my shoe is soaked because I just fell in a little ditch of water. But that's beside the point. I mean, last night, when I woke up from what I believe is neural monitoring, and it's happened more than once, Sharp pain in my frontal lobe, dead center of the forehead. Like somebody beat me with a ball pin hammer. Um, I'm not with that. I'm not trying to feel that, and I'm not trying to hang out with that. So, two or more people. Hindering someone from the life, liberty, pursuit of happiness, or stopping them from having their constitutional rights and state rights. It's 10 year jail, $10,000 fine, plus what you get awarded in damages, and there is, you, 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 would be able to be awarded damages if you had pictures, video, audio, anything to back that up. So, if any government agency deprives you or does the same thing, 10 year, $10,000 fine, 10 year imprisonment, felony, loss of job. And I would hate to think that any officials like that had, would have something to do with it. I really would, but no, I, I don't believe that because you got good ones and you got bad ones. Look at, look at that Baltimore City cop out on a job, on a case. Like two years old, don't even have his service stuff on him. Next day he's supposed to testify, he gets clapped right there. Our state ain't what it used to be, sadly. And how you used to be able to trust people, not even a little bit. I pen letters, four of them, five if you include one that I, I, I've already mentioned out loud, I've penned five, and then I just penned one the other day, would make six, and that's a two-page one. So, I'm not, I'm not hearing this shit no more, like... The old saying, all roads lead to Rome or some shit. Well, something happens to me, even right now. Unless it's an act of God and I get struck by lightning. It's my ID is the clue. But you got to make sure... Everybody gets a polygraph.
each, every single one. Oh, you gonna wear all black, dude, and, you know, act like you turning around and shit. Nah. You gotta love that. When you surprise people, you go away that they don't think you're going. 